Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of my 30 Days to Die series. It is the morning of day 13 and we are getting ready to go out and hit up that oil factory. Now I started a little bit of a hole down here. We're going to actually make this into a mine. Uh, it's going to run out I think uh, that way and this way out to the sides. Uh, not underneath the building so it doesn't collapse here but we'll dig down a fair bit and then make a mine out of this. Uh, so we can get some clay, some stone, what other stuff. But uh, right now let's make our way over. Um, have a look here. We, we don't have any uh, materials on us to, to build anything. I'm going to try and remember to put my lucky goggles on when we loot today. Um, but let's drop some frames. I brought a few extra frames with me today. And nothing really happened last night. It was pretty darn quiet. I thought we would have got a screamer or two, but nothing showed up last night. So we're going to make our way over. Just going to foot it over this morning. I got my bicycle with me, but I don't think we need to ride it over there. Actually, you know what? Let's ride it over. Why not? Be a little faster, and then we can leave it out front. Just so we've got a bit of uh, extra storage before we come back. Now, I'm hoping that we get some good stuff out of this. I am looking for beakers and stuff. Now, I don't think we're going to find any in here, but uh, it is one of the things I'm hoping that we find. Going to resist picking up stones today, too. All right, there's the clunky oil company right here. Going to park the bike right out front, facing the opposite direction, of course. We'll drop her right here. Now, I do have my um, mining helmet on today, just so that I don't forget. Let's get our frames out. Uh, I'm not going to... Where do we want to break in? Like right here, probably. Uh, this will probably be the easiest. Um, I was considering... Somebody, there's another oil company over there. I don't see anybody though. All right, let's break in here. Um, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, I was considering uh pulling over the walls here, but I think it's better to break in. Where is that zombie coming from? I hear him over here. They're Oh, there they are. That guy's wandering around on the inside. Let's see if we can kill these guys. On the ground. Nice. We're going to clear out the outside here first, just so we don't have walkers coming in on us. And if we can get them while they're sleeping, all oh, the better. Yeah, you spotted me. Special delivery. All right, let's see what else we got out here. I'm really hoping there's no birds because I suck at killing the birds. You know that. Yeah. yeah well, I should have moved my way around. Eh, maybe not. Enjoy it, buddy. Enjoy it while you can. There's another guy over there. I wonder if there's anything up here. This actually wouldn't make for a bad horde base. You mean reinforce all these columns and fill this down bottom space here with all spikes? You could just sit up here and shoot down on people. See ya. Yeah, I am not going to push this place too hard. There's a tower we could knock down. Supposedly, if you take out the bottom rungs, this whole thing will collapse. And then it's just mining all the uh, metal as it hits the ground. Or after it hits the ground, that is. So it's kind of an interesting thing. Oh, we got a walker over here. Now, we haven't got into any runners yet. Oh, that's I'm expecting those next. Runners and caps. It looks pretty quiet down here. I wonder if this door is open. Nope. Oh, you... You see that? She just, like, jumped over my arrow.
Somebody inside hears me. Maybe he'll clear me away in. Okay, nobody around this side. I don't want him breaking too much inside though. Because it could break loot, right? There you go. I think there's somebody on the outside here. Yeah, there you are. All right, let's mix it up. May I help you? How are we hitting this guy? That is so weird. Sure, I'll take it. Okay, I got my shotgun on me for dogs and runners and spider monkeys. Okay, we got a worker. For every one of these guys that I killed like this, there's going to be 10 more that are going to sneak up on my ass. All right, let's kill and then loot. Somebody's angry. Why are they always angry at me? I didn't really do anything wrong. All right, where is he breaking out? Oh, there you are. Come on. Trying not to make any sound at all, or yet they're still hearing me. Ooh. Well, I thought there was a certain way you needed to go through this place, but I'll let them decide that. This doesn't look good. Oh, this is outside. Okay. Well. Well. Time to wake up, people. I'm coming for you. Just looking down because I don't know if... Uh... Don't know if there's anybody beside the doors. I don't know if that guy's outside or what. Huh. Better pick these up. Just in case we don't want them to explode on us. I don't know why I'm creeping. These people can see me no matter what I do here. Where's the stairs? Right there. Somebody else beating on over there. That sounds like it hurts their hand, though. I mean, I know they're dead, but still, like... Kind of reminds me of, um... Sorry, I'm just listening here for a second. Kind of reminds me of, um... What was it called now? Uh, was it Kumite? No. It's a Jean-Claude Van Damme movie where he uh, plays like this uh, kickboxer. His brother goes into the uh, fight and he's got to fight Chung Lee or whatever the guy's name was. I don't remember what his name was. Anyways, so uh, Van Damme is like walking around and trying to convince his brother not to fight. But he goes, he's in, he's underground and or in the um, the areas where the fight, oh, there's the guy down there. They're in the area where the fighters are um, warming up and stuff. And he um, starts hearing this thudding sound. So he goes down to check out what's going on. And there's Chung Lee kicking a solid concrete post over and over and over again. And he's like, I don't think you should fight this guy. <laughs> so yeah, you think? Guy's kicking a concrete post, man. You don't want to fight him. 
If he's used to kicking concrete posts, your weak ass body ain't gonna be nothing to him. So yeah, that's kind of reminds me what it sounds like. Although it just wasn't as rapid, it was just more like a boom, boom, boom. And he's like, what the hell is that sound? And he goes, it's like echoing everywhere, right? There's Chung Lee kicking the friggin' concrete pole. I think the guy's name is, the actor's name is Bolo Young. Wow, that's it for this? That's it? This is it? Well, that was sort of counter, um... Uh, I, I don't even know what to say. There's like fuel barrels here. But that's it? Clunky Oil Company's got nothing? Wow. Okay. Well, if we need fuel barrels, we know where to come for the next place. Let's go cap and ban bandana. Uh, where do these go? Let's find out. Ah, okay, there's more places over here. This is outside, though. Let's not go that way. Let's go this way. There just seems to be an awful lot of hidden places here. Probably should have the bat out for this. All right. Taking the water, cause it's worth taking. Let's get to looting. You darn tootin', let's get to looting. Nothing. Okay, another office. Oh, it's the angry guy. Swing bada swing. I checked that, right? Yep. Alright, suits in here. Yeah, I wasn't worried. I thought it was somebody would have woken up by now. If there's anybody in here. What's this? Impact bracing schematic. Okay, that locked. That's locked. That be locked. Take those for sale. Oh come on. Scrap this. Any lead we can find at this point is probably a good idea. We've only got 200 and something lead. Take the corn. Gonna replace, gonna be uh, planting that at some point. I think clunky oil will have more oil in it. All right, let's break through these. There's some shufflers down there. I'm hearing them. Getting paranoid now. Hear him? Don't know if that's a crawler or what. They just seem to be coming out of nowhere now. Yeah, I'm getting worried. I don't mind a good fight, but I hate it when they sneak up on you. It scares the crap out of me. I don't know why I'm stealthing. I still got like a hundred percent visual on me. This is the noise I'm making here. Okay, he's off to the right now. He's in there. I'm gonna pull this out just in case. Oh no, it's just a You scared the hell out of me, buddy! That's just not nice. So this is what you get for that. A shot in the pills. Ah, uh, it was a shin shot. Alright, let's see what's up on the upstairs. Before we loop below. There's still people, man. That's a walker, though. I wonder if there was like a minor horde that kind of came by when we were in here. Check this out.
Oh, okay. Uh, we can finally shoot through these bars. Yeah, you take a breath there for a second. It's hard work trying to break through metal. Okay, I don't see any birds up here. It's a good thing, I guess. Now, can we get up? Oh, we can. Um. Okay. Don't see anything else up on the roof there. Now, does that have oil in it? Or is that just... For show? Alright, let's dig our way in here. How long is it going to take? Jesus Christ, probably not. Uh, oh, that's 300. Ooh. Okay. So we do a little bit of stair stepping. Like so. And then we drop you here. Boom, problem solved. Shotgun Messiah, I love it. All right, see what we got. Uh, uh. Oh, sniper rifle, rifle, helmet light, more shotgun rounds, a better shotgun. Um, all right, it's loaded already. Oh, come on. Wow, that was, uh, that kind of worked out. Nice, let's see what else we got down here on the main level. Have a, look, a quick look around. I'm not going to bother holding that out, though. Probably should. Nails, some brass. Scrap that. Should probably make a round trip over to the bike. Let's go around this way. And we'll come back and finish looting. We'll go in the back door we went in before. But we'll come, go around the other way and do it. All right, let's just get our garbage on this side. What do you got? Ah, one dollar. A dollar's a dollar. Okay, nothing there. It's all quiet. Someone broke in from the outside that way. Cathino token. Uh, let's scrap this. Check you for some glue. And there'll be some fuel in here we can grab. Not bad. Let's drop this in the bike. Alright, let's find a different POI too. Let's go drop this stuff off at home in a minute here. Storage. So let's put all the single items uh, in here. Um, those are stackable. Those are singles. Got two, room for two more. Shotgun. Uh, another shotgun. Okay, cool. I don't think it really matters if I, if I do that or not. Alright. Let's go back in, grab what else we, whatever else we can here. Go around the outside. We'll go in the back door, scrap this, take the paper. We need those for shotgun rounds. Lead. Zamboni on the outside. You break your way in, I ain't going out to you. Some more pills. Can't see how passing out pills is very hard work. Come on, buddy. Break in in here. I don't really want that. I think we can make antibiotics with it, but we don't really need to. Scrap. Take the cans. From what I remember, I think you can make fuel or something out of the cans. I can't remember. Take that. Anything around here? Nothing around here. Garbage. Yay, level up. Oh yeah, there's another safe down here too. More oil. Another garbage. 
nothing and scrap and paper all right let's break that goes outside so let's break this out man it's nice when these things are only like 22 hits as opposed to like 220 hits <laughs> I know I'm, I'm exaggerating it's not 220 but still it's a lot of hits normally all right let's grab this I don't think there's anything on the next floor though but we'll go up and have a quick look that guy sounds like he's broken his way in. He's around here somewhere. Oh, slow metabolism. That's another 75 we can sell. Yeah, I think there was nothing else up here. Uh, this was just empty, right? Oh, we got one thing of trash up here. I think we... Yeah, yeah, we cleared up here, right? This was like a... A lot of nothing. Right, let's go down. And we'll drop our stuff off at home. Let's just break our way out here. Don't know if that zombie gave up or if he's outside. I don't see him in here anywhere. Eh, I probably gave up. Alright, let's go home, drop the stuff off. All right, we got ourselves an airdrop, guys. Let's go get that. Uh, where did it go? All right, probably in the snow biome. Yep, actually that's not too far away. We're gonna go hit that up. Let's go drop all this stuff off first. We'll go hit up that. We're gonna go to the trader too, I think. If we're gonna go out, we might as well go to the trader. I got a bunch of stuff I can sell. I want to try and pick up some more ammo, I think. Uh, I don't know what else here. So let's drop all the weapons and stuff in here. Uh, crossbow bolts, compound bow, uh, ammunition. Uh, what else? Anything? Don't think so. Schematics, no. So that can go in here. So let's drop in this stuff. Um, you, you, I missed that one. Oil, nails, gunpowder. Put the office chairs in here. We're going to break those up. I broke my other ones up already. Um, brass we need to put in and melt. Might as well drop it in here for now. Let's just put them down here so I know where they are. Gas, glue. Um, and then in here we got the corn. Murky water. Um, Potato seed, empty jars. You get the wood. Uh, that's it. Now, do we keep the schematics? Where are we keeping them? Over here, right? Oh, yeah, we are. All right, so schematics. So let's go see if we can sell. We don't have a lot to sell, I don't think. So maybe we don't bother. Well, we got these. Um, hmm. We do have, I mean, he wasn't willing to buy a lot of the other guns that we had, so. And we never put our looting goggles on again. Ah, oh, for Christ's sake. For those of you who haven't been watching my other series, you probably don't know that I'm uh, ADD. Now you do. I'm sure you, you figured that out already. Uh, where am I putting, wait, right here. These guys can go in there. These guys can go in there. I want to save these for Hornet. We got lots of ammo. Let's see what we can sell to that guy. Hunting rifle, I think, well, you know what, we got the sniper rifle now, so I don't think we really need the hunting rifle. Let's go grab the stuff from the bike. All right. They should um, set it up so that you can, uh, actually, let's leave the bike there. So that when you come down, if you put take the bike, it automatically dumps stuff in your inventory. And then if you don't, um, if you don't um, have enough room, then it'll give you that little uh, notification. Okay, he didn't want to buy the pistols before. He might buy the two shotguns. So let's try that. We've already got a bandana on. We've got a skull cap already. Helmet light. Um, 
Yeah, let's leave that in there. We got extra lucky goggles so we can sell those. Uh, I wonder if he'll buy the iron pickaxe. What else do we have? He might buy the iron fire axe, which we don't really need to keep. We could sell a machete. Got another iron pickaxe. Another iron fire axe. Machete, probably. Maybe he'll buy that. Um, yeah. And I think... What are we wearing right now? Another poncho. Let's grab the puffer coat out of here. Probably going to need that and our hat when we go pick up the... Uh, well, you know what? We probably, we're probably we probably not going to need these because we're just going to ride down and grab it and come back. So let's go do that. Let's go down and get the... Um, it's, how's our stone doing, by the way? Jesus, we need a hell of a lot more wood in there. Uh, these guys are... Actually, you know what? Let's put in... Before we forget here. Because we know how forgetful we are. Let's put this in here this in here turn this on and let's grab some wood out and we'll put uh, a little bit of wood whoops in here actually we're not even going to need anywhere near that much that'll go fast like just put that much in there but this this over here is going to take quite a while. So we'll throw all that in there. Alright, let's go to the trader. Actually, no, we're going to go grab the uh, airdrop first. Then we're going to the trader. So let's go do this. Alright, here we are. It's got to be right here somewhere. Over here? Oh yeah, that's right. Landed over here somewhere. By the fire station? Did it land on the fire station? Huh. Yeah, I know I'm cold. Did we check all these cars? We haven't touched these cars yet either. Yep. Somebody knows we're here. Hey, what's up, buddy? He doesn't seem to be too pleased that we're here, though. I mean, let's face it, I'm probably not the most cool, charismatic person in the world, but not enough to hate me that much. See that? Kill him, the sun comes out. It's a beautiful day. Five bucks. I'm freezing. Um... Okay. And we got another sniper rifle. Sure. Let's go sell this one. Let's get the hell out of here. We're going to freeze our ass off. Move it, move it, move it. Maybe we go in the school here. I'll have to hit that up another day. No idea what's in there. I've been in the Tiny Tots daycare. Oh, there's a rabbit. Silly rabbit. Tricks are for kids. Do we go into this passing gas yet? I don't know. We need to get out of the cold first. Or we die of hypothermia here. What's up, buddy? Not that much, huh? Alright, we should warm up pretty fast here, I think. Okay, let's get up to the trader. He's really close by, which is great. I like actually settling close to a trader. It's better if everything works, like when you get there and you, like, if anything, the forge or the cement mixer, the two that you really want to work. I mean, you can make your own forges, but why have the early heat in your game, right? Or at your location, you might as well have it at the trader's place. Let him worry about the screamers. But then I guess you have to worry about it too when you uh, come to visit it a bit. But not that much. Alright, let's see what you got up here, buddy. What 
can I get you today? Uh, not much, but I do have some stuff to sell you. Let's sell you this for 105, and let's sell you these for 525, and then let's sell you some of those, and some of these, and this, and this helmet, because I don't want it. Uh, will you buy the iron pickaxe? You certainly will. And this one, eight, huh? Well, I'll take it. Thirteen, really? Whatever. Twelve. Okay, uh, we want to keep that. Yeah, some cash. Whole nine. These old shotguns. Uh, One seventy-two, huh? Seventy-six. Uh, I'm thinking we're gonna hang on to the extra extra marksman rifle. The shotgun can go though. And this compound bow. Okay. We got 3193 now. Uh, what do you got? Black leather duster. It's good for the desert. Even not bad for cold. I wonder if we should buy that. 950? Can we actually make those? I don't know. We'll find out in a second. Suit pants. I want to be good looking? Nah, probably not. Uh, two pistols, old cash, overalls, rockets, candles, hidden strike, 9mm rounds, which we've got a ton of. That's a great claw hammer, but I can make those later on. Bucket, leather gloves, padded armor, and then all the stuff I sold you. Ah, uh, okay. Restock is day 16, so it's pretty darn close. What do you got in here? Padded leg armor we can make our own. Weighted head, 832. Modification for medium and heavy melee items. Chance to stun and slow victims. We don't have any heavy melee items, so not really worth it. HE rockets. 420 explosion damage. Barrel extender. What does this do? Increased damage, range, and aimed accuracy, but makes the weapon more unwieldy when fired from the hip. So is that, I guess that's got to be a modifier then. That would be great for the sniper rifle. Don't want to spend a thousand on it though. That's a question. Well, it's day, it's what, it's day 13 today, so we got time. We've got time. So let's not worry about that today. And with you too, my friend. And with you too. Alright, let's get back home. Now, we have to make armor at some point, but not right away. Actually, you know what? Let's go find a POI on the way home. You know what we should do? No, I know what we're going to do. I know totally what we're going to do. We never did finish off that POI close to our house, the bunker. We did, um, we started it, and we decided not to go down in the bunker, bunker portion of it. And then I never went back. I don't know why I didn't go back and finish it up. So let's go park. Actually, let's just go um, right to where it is, which is like right here, I think. Is it not? Whoops. Whoops. Right here. Yeah, man. All right, let's just pick this up. And we're going to go break our way in a different way. Because I'm just that kind of guy. Let's do it here in the toilet. Like, how can you, like, anyway, whatever. Uh, maybe not. Right here, probably. All right, let's eat something here and yeah, drink something. So we're getting really low on stamina. So my suggestion, you know, if you ever find this base, is to just knock this out and knock this out, right? I'd probably knock all the stairs out, but put a ladder up here and then live on the upper floor because this place is so solid, it's ridiculous, right? An early game, 
it will make for a wonderful base. Day seven horde, forget it. Just put spikes around this thing. No one's getting in, right? You don't even have to do anything but spikes, right? You break in down here, and let's get a ladder. Um, well, we've only got enough wood for two, so that's all we're using. Got frames if we need them, but one, two. Gonna need more than that, but whatever. Right, you can break in here. There's a workbench down here. And it's actually working. Nice. Right? And then you go down here. Just don't do just don't do this at night. Gotta be careful they don't destroy the You know what? Let's freaking wake them up. The thing you got to worry about is them destroying all this stuff here. Alright, let's loot this stuff. This is the quickest way, right? You break in from above, grab the loot, and bail. Just make sure they don't uh, break any of these things. Hey, plastic. Oh, nice fire axe. Pistols should have come here first, man. We could have sold all this stuff to the trader. Oh, there's the AK. Oh my god, full military armor? Are you kidding me? What the hell? Are you kidding me? I'm shocked that nobody else woke up here. Alright, let's grab all this material. This place is kind of nice. There's like a kitchen and everything over there. But I wouldn't spend time underground during the horde. Because they'll burrow right down to you. They have no compunction of, of burrowing right down and killing you. And destroy your base in the process. So just use the upstairs. And if you're inventive enough, you could fill in the entire underneath of the second floor with just concrete. Right? So it's like good luck for them to get to you. They'd never knock the building down in time. Alright, let's loot this stuff. Question is, do I just want to go home now? I mean, we've made our way into the good spot. Grabbed all the good loot. Let's see if there's anybody else here that we can just see. I mean, there's the bookshelf down there that we could go to. Uh, yeah, I don't think we really need to. You know what? Let's go drop this stuff home. Yeah, come on. And then we'll get back here. We've got, like, there's stuff in here too, right? Glass jars. More ammo, which is always welcome. More ammo. Don't know how that did that, but whatever. Oop, that would have been bad. Imagine triple tapping that sucker. Okay, duct tape. Okay. You know, I should probably just wrench this uh, workbench apart. But I mean, if you broke all this stuff... Because these walls are really tough, right? You could just fill all this in with concrete, build a ladder down in the center here. Right? It would have been, like, easy. Nope. I don't think I can get this ladder. Do I have enough wood? I don't have any wood, do I? So, let's put you on the belt. And let's grab... Uh, how much wood do I need? I need three, right, for a ladder? I do. 
Perfect. And this can be an emergency horde base. Right? If we absolutely need to, we can make that an emergency horde base. Wow, we're really going slow. Maybe I connect it. That's the other thing. It's like, we're going to have enough time. It's only day 13, right? I could build a tunnel under here and go right into there. And then if something crazy happened over here, we could always just go through the tunnel and go up in there and have that as a second base. You know, and if you were playing the seven days version, like seven days to die, as opposed to 30 like I am, you could actually just... Um, Use that as your starter base while you build a new one over here or wherever you were building. Right? You really have to do too much work on it either. That's the beautiful thing about it. Alright, let's put in all the good stuff in here. Um, ammo. Compound bow level 6. We're going to keep this one out. Steel fire axe. was repaired by steel. I'm going to leave it in here for now because I don't really have a lot of steel to be we'd be repairing this thing with. And then let's leave the armor in here. Uh, what else do we have? Iron arrowheads. Let's leave those out because we're going to turn those into arrows. Uh, rifle, ammo. More ammo. Alright. This can go in here. Um, here. This is done, right? Yeah. Don't know if it, if uh, I don't know if it's just going to be one that we need there, but we'll see. That can go in there. That can go in there. That can go in there. Um, resources didn't get a whole lot, but we got a fair bit anyway. That can go in there. We're going to take stock of all this stuff we've got. These things that we can use, like the helmet light and stuff. Um, Alright, the moldy bread can go in here. Saving that just to make antibiotics with. Alright, we need four feathers. So, and we need four wood. Um, arrows. So that should be done, right? Yeah, we got all that in there. Nice. How's this going still? Jesus Christ, going forever. We're gonna be making a lot of cement, though. We're gonna need a hell of a lot of concrete for it to, to, like, to do exactly what I want to do. All right, let's bring this guy out of here. Um, modify. Let's bring the green dye out. Complete. Compound bow. Uh, modify. Green dye. Complete. Now we need a repair kit to fix that. I think we do have... Yeah, we got lots. So let's put this guy in there. And let's repair this. And since we got lots, let's repair this. Nice. Okay, whoops. Iron arrows can go in here now too. Alright, we're looking pretty good. So let's go. We got a little bit of time. So I think next episode, what we're going to do, since we didn't really get too much done with regards to looting places, is we're going to hit up these this place here tomorrow and see what we can get out of there. Let's grab a few of these trees while we're out here. Clear that building across the street from us. Well, buildings. I'm hoping... That we get some good loot out of it, but can't guarantee it. There's six trailer trailers there. So, if we're lucky, we'll find some half-decent loot. And if we're not, well, such is life. There we go. Alright, so that's that done. We got a bunch of wood. 2,600 to be precise. That's pretty good. Drop all that off in here. So I think probably what I'll do tonight is I'll start doing a bit of digging. Um, 
and getting that hole figured out down there got a bit of a ladder starting there we're going to dig down i don't know probably normally i dig down so that the uh, we are two blocks high going along and on the floor we'll we'll um have a wooden uh base so we can run along the wood but the top floor like the top the upper block as we're digging will be clay and the lower block will be stone um that way we can get a lot of each as we're as we're digging out the uh, things so we'll have uh, two blocks of stone one block of clay the bottom block will end up being wood as we go along and i can show you that next time uh, but yeah, so I'll probably do that a bit of that tonight and then the next episode when we come back We're gonna go across the street to the trailer park uh, and hit that up clear that out um, Just to see what's over there. I've never been in a trailer park um, Before so I have no idea what to expect. Hopefully it'll be something interesting uh, Also keep in mind too that I'm uh, pre-recording a lot of these episodes So uh, any any of your comments most likely will be read after the following episodes have been made Um so yeah, that's kind of how that's going to go. So actually, before we go, let's have a quick look at our skill points here. We got one available. Um, what can we get here? Anything on this end of things? Uh, we have advanced engineering. We need. We're waiting to get um, this here. It's level forty, intellect seven. We're kind of a fair ways off right now. What level are we? We are level thirty-three. We're not that far off. So we're going to have to save up three points to get this to level seven. Then we can buy this. So we need four skill points for that. So we'll, we're going to have, yeah, a few. So we're going to hold on to this right now. We'll get our intellect up one more point before we do. Uh, go ahead and, and uh, buy anything else. All right. So I'm going to end the episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, you can drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And you can drop any comments or, or concerns in the, in the uh, comment section down below. And until next time, we'll see you later.